a coast and welcome to my channel a coast where you at that was unnecessary today i am bringing you a quick and easy breakfast kind of snack type of thing after the gym i usually make this right after i go to the gym and i love to make it because it's quick simple and under 30 minutes because that's what my life needs under 30 minutes before we get started, make sure to like, subscribe, and click that little button next to subscribe, that little bell, to make sure that you actually get notified when I post videos. So stick around and let's see just how quick, easy, and good this little rap thing is. I am starting off with some olive oil. It doesn't matter what brand you want to use. Use whatever or whatever oil you want to use. Um, I'm also frying up some onions. I added salt onto it because it brings out the liquid that's in the onion and fries it up really well. Added in my tomatoes. I use cherry tomatoes. You don't have to use cherry tomatoes. You can use whatever tomatoes you have on hand. So I let that simmer for a bit, make sure that it gets really soft, and then I added in some red peppers because that's what I had on hand. And then went in and added my spinach, and then like a little um, greens mix, is spinach, chard, and I believe kale in this mix. Now the reason why I love making this wrap is that you can virtually add any vegetables that you want to add to this wrap. This is just what I had on hand. If you want to experiment with this, go right ahead. I love recipes that I can just toss in whatever I have available. And that's basically how I'm living my life right now. <laughs> just whatever I have. I'm a great struggle chef and I do well with whatever ingredients I have available. So go ahead and let that simmer. Sim simmer. <laughs> who got the bees to my and I, oh, oh. that is not the worry is who got the keys to my beam all right anyway so while that is simmering this is now the perfect time to figure out if you need more of something i went ahead and added more greens to it because y'all know how spinach <laughs> operates if you add a lot it still looks like you added nothing so i added more spinach and that charred mix in there i also went ahead and seasoned my vegetables again season this however you would like to i just added in some garlic uh, turmeric I also added in a little bit of Maggie if you're not familiar with Maggie cube it's kind of like a, a flavor cube it's like like a bouillon cube kinda kinda if you are interested in switching over and adding more plant-based um, food into your diet or more plant-based meals I would say try to season it the same don't do like a drastic change of just adding no seasoning to your food try to season it the same some well seasoned vegetables goes a very long way definitely not eating all those eggs by myself don't try me <laughs> I'm not that fat I'm not eating all these eggs by myself but yes pick however many eggs you want to use I seasoned my eggs with um, an herb mix so like a seasoned herb mix and then I added in some pepper and a little bit of Maggie Maggie does wonders for some eggs I wouldn't do it all the time because it's just not that healthy for you but it's really good in some eggs. I'm using a spinach wrap that I got from Publix. You can use whatever type of wrap that you have available. I also spread it on some hummus. I also had some pre-made quinoa that I added to this. Quinoa doesn't take a long time to make at all. Just put it on the stove and boil it up till it gets like semi-soft texture. It's always good to just have some on hand too. Add in all of the ingredients that you want on your wrap. Be mindful that if you overfill this wrap, it might be just a little bit difficult to actually get it to wrap. To finish up this meal, I think what really helps to make this wrap so good is to put it back in the frying pan and just crisp up the sides a little bit. So I put it back in the frying pan inside of some coconut oil. You can use whatever oil you want to use and just crisp up the sides and all over it 
gives it a little bit of crunch and I really like that flavor that it gives it too. If you prefer not to do that, then you can just leave the wrap as is and go ahead and enjoy. I added in some sriracha while I was eating this and then I also finished this off with some juice that I made myself. If you are interested in my quick, easy juicing recipe, please make sure to click the link above. Starbucks little wraps ain't got nothing on me. I make recipes like this all the time. I just don't always record this. But if you want to see them, just let me know and I will definitely do that next time. Just your neighborhood struggle chef signing out, a coast in your kitchen. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share with your friends. And thank you for sticking around until next time. See ya! I am on a mission to get to 500 subscribers by Christmas time. So please, please, please share and subscribe. Let all of your friends know to come check out my videos. I have tons of videos on this channel, so please check it out. And thank you for watching. I usually post every Tuesday by 3 p.m. if life doesn't get in the way. If it does, then it's just going to be extended. But if not, I usually post on time every Tuesday. Uh, rise and shine, gotta get the day started, sun beaming in my face as the blessings keep falling.